little name calling in South Carolina as well. You have a governor's race there. Nikki Haley is the governor. Uh, she is comfortably ahead in this race. I want you to listen to Vincent Shaheen. He's the Democrat at a rally here. A bit of a slip of the tongue, and then instead of fixing it right away, he decides to enjoy it. She vetoed our public school teachers' pay raises the same year she gave her own staff 25% pay increases. That is the worst kind of politics, and we are going to escort her out the door. We're going to escort her out the door. Yeah. Yeah. This is the test of a candidate. He realizes he had slipped his tongue. He fixes it right away and says her, but then when the crowd's loving it, he laughs and smiles too. Uh, he's losing, uh, but a good candidate says, whoa, right there, right? Yeah, and I think that's what happened there. I, yeah. I think he could have handled that better, and he just didn't. But I also think there's a little bit of jumping on this for the sake of jumping it because we're at the final throes of that campaign. Right, and jumping on it because some Republicans say that if a Republican had done this, you right. would have women's organizations oh, jumping absolutely. out all over the place. The National Organization for Women, Emily says, listen to Ann Romney. She told CNN's Peter Hamby, when I first heard about it, it hit me right in my gut. My nerve endings went haywire. It's so upsetting when you know someone can say something like that about a woman and not have any kind of reaction. It's so unacceptable. Nikki's a great girl and has been a great governor. Uh, an honest reaction from Ann Romney there, I believe, Ed, but also there is this conservatives thinking that if a Republican had done that and used that word in the final week of a campaign. And they're sensitive to it because these types of things have been said about her before by members of both parties and, I, and, and they've been rightly called out for, for saying them. Right. And, and the fact that this is on video, the right. fact that he so clearly didn't do anything to reverse himself and say, hey, mm -hmm. that's, not, that's, that's not how my campaign's right. being run. We're not going to behave that way. I mean, he's losing, and, and this might not help. He's losing, and when you're losing, also your future can depend on exactly. this. It's not, you know, you've run once, run twice, maybe you have a future if you run a close race. If you do something like that, it makes people think not ready for prime time. One week 